Hey guys, Brandon Laser here, and I'm playing a Salvodad deck, as the picture suggests. Basically, uh, I'm playing against a Heraldic Mandacore of Darkness build of some sort, which is really cool. I really like Mandacore of Darkness. And so he gets his Heraldic Lion effect off. I summoned a Cyber Valley, um, not expecting him to warning it, but that's okay, because I like it when people warning stuff super early like that, that I'm re not really worried about. So, basically... I take both the hits just to get out my gores at a, a larger attack. I kind of feel like I probably should have just attacked instead of getting greedy and trying to bring out uh, Caius, but, you know, things happen, so that'll teach me for next time. I reborn his card trooper because I was trying to mill to get three. I got greedy, and, and I, I hit three darks instead of one dark and two whatevers. So it just didn't work out, but he was going. He was he was trying to go crazy. So I had to, I had to torrential, even though I don't get the effect, or unless it does, and Devpo just doesn't work like that. Either way, so I set my Sangan, and he doesn't. You know, he brings out, he hits it, and then it gives me a Cyber Valley, which is really cool. And then history repeats itself, and he stops that one too. So he just goes. He he really likes. Stop, he doesn't want me to have any draw power, and luckily I had a Cyber Dragon. Got to bring that out. Um, he hits me with 17, and that's the last hit he gets, because I'm about to draw a Pot of Avarice, and I play it, leaving three darks in the graveyard, and allowing me to summon Dad, giving me the game, and he scoops. So, that was really cool. Um, the deck is really explosive, and it, it has a, a couple of consistency issues, but it, uh, I think after a little bit of fine-tuning, it'll work out really well. So, I'm playing against some kind of burn deck. As soon as he plays Duality, I, I know what I'm playing against. I'm playing against Burn. I thought I was playing against Stereotypical Chain Burn, or maybe something like that, but it turns out to be something um, unconventional, so lucky for me. You know, I hit, I flip up my deck Oichi and hit into his Fire Monster, and that ends the turn because he played Wabaku. So then he sets a couple more cards, and I'm like, well, great. Now I'm going to, you know, more Burn. And it turns out not to be, which is awesome. So he activates Reckless Greed, draws two cards, Brings out that guy since they're both 14. Bring out my uh, tour guide and bring out an acid golem to attack into him. Play ceasefire, does some more burn damage. Brings out another one, and that guy's effect is if you deal if you deal burn damage, or if burn damage happens in the turn, then you can special summon him from your hand and deal an, an additional 400. So I have an acid golem now on the board. I'm, I'm, per, I'm in a pretty good position. I have a trag in my hand. He has like pretty much nothing. Um, I don't want that Acid Golem to start burning me more, giving him any kind of advantage, so I just pay its cost and get rid of it with Cyber Dragon. Uh, I hit him directly, and then he removes that guy to burn me some more, which puts me pretty close to game. But um, I noticed that he didn't activate that other trap, and I just drew my Salvo, so I'm going to go into Scrap Dragon, which is really awesome. You know, they set a Battle Fader, give me 8. I pop my Cyber Dragon, hit his newly set Cylinder, bring out Dad, and strike for game. So I'm, I'm really digging... Uh, you know, Salvo Dad. It's really fun, and basically, you know, I think it's still a pretty viable deck. Um, you know, it's not super, super fast. It isn't super crazy, like, you know, powerful. I mean, it is explosively, but I think that with a few tweaks here and there, it could be really good. So in the comment section below, let me know what you think about the deck. What you think, let me know what you think about the duels. You can, you, can, you know, constructive criticism. You can bring out my, my misplays, but just be constructive about it. Uh, hit the like and subscribe button, and thanks for watching.